any of y'all that were around during the True Support campaign, you know what we did. You know, we sold units. You know that Billboard emailed me two days before the charts were coming out and saying, hey, we need an updated photo. We need a full bio. We need a digital copy of the album. Can you answer these questions about your background? Because there's a high chance you're going to be on the charts this week. You know, they're not emailing nobody randomly out of blue. He had to hunt me down to find that email, too. We have the Nielsen screenshot from Nielsen SoundScan that shows where I charted on each chart for Billboard, because this is where they get the data from, MRC data. I'm about to break all that down for you. And when the chart came out, I wasn't on there. And I started asking around and calling people that were in the industry, because I know people in the industry, too. And they were like, yo, yeah, you made the chart, but they didn't want to put you on there because you'd be talking about the music industry. I'm like, they mad at me for telling the truth about what they do. So they're going to leave me off of a rigged ass chart because I tell people that the chart's rigged as opposed to honoring the true album sales. Oh, OK. All right, bet. And at the time, I was a little disappointed because that was a part of our true support campaign was a chart on Billboard, 